All right, everyone, it is Coach Josh here with the video on how to make a ninja throwing star. Are you guys ready? All right, here we go. So, there are a couple things that you will need that you might need to ask a parent for. So, those things are scissors, which you'll definitely need a parent for this one just so they can cut the paper because I do not want y'all to cut yourselves. So you have scissors and also some paper. There we go. Many, many papers. Good. So what you need is two sheets of paper. So I'm going to come right here. I'm going to tear out any two sheets I want. There we go. Let's see. Is this one or two sheets? That's one. Now I need is one more. Ah, there we go. That's two sheets of paper. So now once you got those two sheets, you can put your notebook away. So you can put them side by side, just saying, hey, I got my sheets, I got my sheets. All right, perfecto. Now, with one of your sheets, whichever one you want to use first, all we're going to do then you're going to fold it just like this. So you're going to take one corner, and you're going to put it all the way over here. So you're going to put that corner right there against that side, and you're going to make sure the sides are right by each other. Once you know that the sides are right by each other, you're going to pinch this side right here, and you're going to go all the way down. All the way down, just like that. Good, and then squeeze it tight. Don't let any air bubbles come out. Squeeze them out, squeeze them out. Good, make it flat, make it flat. Good. Now, with this part right here, this is where you might need a parent to help you cut your paper. So, I have my scissors right here. I'm gonna put them right along this. And all I'm gonna do is just cut all the way down. Good, just keep on cutting. Make sure not to cut too fast. So cut nice and slow. Good, just all the way down that line. Almost there. Almost there. And we are at the end. So good. So that right there, that's a pretty nice triangle, isn't it? But what happens if you unfold it? <gasps> then you have a square. So good job. So that is the first part. So the first part is just to get a square. Now, after you have that square, all you're going to do is fold it in half just like that. Any way you want. Just fold it all the way in half. Make sure that this right here is lined up. You don't want any edges showing. Good. So you're going to fold it in half just like that. You're going to crease it down, crease it down. Good. Now, you're going to open it up. Good. Now that's all good. Now you're going to put now that you know that it's all good, you're going to fold it this way, just so you can know where the middle middle is. I know you have your half, I know you already put in half, but now you have an extra, extra middle. See, X marks the spot right there. So, you're gonna fold it in half just like that one more time. And then you're gonna fold it in half again. Good. So you're going to do this with both papers. So you're going to fold it in half and cut it just like that. So remember, we start it with a big paper. And then we, so we started with a big paper just like this. We made a triangle out of it. We cut off the bottom part, which gave us a square. After we did that, we folded the square in half to make a nice rectangle. And then we just folded that in half one more time. So once you do that with both sides, you're going to have two sheets of paper that look the same. So I have this one right here, and I have this one right here. So these are going to be the two sides of your throwing star or shuriken. So with each one of these, you're going to grab it, and you're going to fold it in half. 
Just like that. I know. We're folding a lot of things in half. But that's what we got to do. We're going to fold in half just like that. Good. Make sure your edges are all good side by side. Good, good, good. And then you're going to unfold it. I know. Folding, unfolding. But we got this. You're going to do it with this one too. Good. So you're going to fold it in half and then unfold it. Now, once you have where your halfway is, if you want, just so you can see it a little bit better, you can get a marker or a pencil or a pen and just mark that. So I have a marker right here. So I'm going to get my halfway and I'm going to mark it just so I can know where it is. Perfect. Now, this is the part where it gets kind of tricky. So you're going to have to do different things with each side. So with this side right here, I'm going to grab this corner. I'm going to put all the way over here. So that this side right here, so you want this edge to be lined up with your mark on the outside just like that. Good. Good job, guys. All right, so you can do that with this side. Now with this one, you're going to do the opposite. So with this one right here, you're going to fold it right there. And it's going to go all the way out. So now you have two that look nothing alike or they are mirrors of each other so good so after that with this one right here you're going to fold it to the middle of these and then do you know what you're going to do with this side i'm sure you did you're going to pull it right over here good so now you see how they kind of look at each other like this this is what you want to have right there just so they're looking at each other. Now once you have them looking at each other, you're going to turn them up. So now they're gonna look at each other this way. All right, here we go, here we go, here we go. It's about to get real. Are you ready? Good. All right, so once you have it there, you're gonna grab either side you want. And all you're gonna do, you're just gonna flip it over this way you're going to flip this side over this way. Good. And with this right here, you're going to fold it out. Good. And I'm going to fold this one in. Good, good, good. All right. And then with this one, I'm going to do the same thing. So I'm going to fold this out. Ooh, I think I might have messed up on this one, but that's okay. Good, you're going to do the same thing right there. All right, good. So now that you got that part down, now with this one right here, now that you got to fold it nice and good, nice and good, you're going to fold it down this way, you're going to fold it in here. Good, you can do the same thing with this. You're going to fold it in here. You're going to fold it in here. Now, I know I said this before, but this is really the tricky part. So now, you see how there's a line right here where this doesn't fold on? Remember that spot on both of them. So now what you're going to do with them, you're going to put those parts on the outside of both you're going to have these foldy parts right here. They're going to kind of hug the other one. So good. So you want both your papers to have big, nice hugs. So good. They're going to hug each other. They're going to hug each other. And then look, it already looks like one. But there's one thing you have to do because if you try to throw it like this, it's just going to fall apart. And you don't want that. Good. So you're going to try to put this foldy part right here into that hole and you're going to put this one right here in to uh, almost got it almost got it uh, that one there we go so now you have one side down you see that you have one side down now you have to flip it over and now you have one more side here we go you're gonna put that one in there and you're gonna put this one in there
And there you go, guys. That's how you fold your very own throwing star. And then once you got it, just give it a flick. Boop. And it throws just like butter. Good job, guys. Y'all did amazing. I hope y'all use these wisely. And do not throw them at your brothers and sisters or your parents. Only throw it at soft things with the permission of your parents. See you guys.